Community Manager with Code Academy, and today's quick tip video for chapter leaders is three reasons why you might consider having a co-leader. A co-leader for your chapter is totally optional and not necessary, but I have seen some really cool stuff happening in the chapters that have co-leaders. So I thought that I would bring those observations out and share them with you. So number one reason to have a co-leader for your chapter is planning and promoting. Those are two separate jobs and two pretty big jobs. Um, planning your actual event is obviously something that you want to do every single time because you want to have that information listed on your agenda so that people can make decisions about coming to your meetup. Um, and then promoting it, holy smokes, that has to happen in partnership with HQ, but then also on your own social media. So I'm seeing fantastic stuff happening with people who are creating Instagram accounts and Twitter accounts. And um, while one person can totally do this and have a lot of fun doing it, I think it would be uh, or I think it can be a really great thing um, to split up between two people. So that's number one, planning and promoting. Number two, moderating a meetup. Um, I am sure you can imagine I've been a participant and a um, moderator for a number of virtual events and can't stress enough the sense of relief <laughs> and having somebody to co-moderate. Um, usually, or at least lately, that's been either Lil or Mike, whom you've met in the process of becoming a chapter leader. And I'm so grateful for them. So I just want to share that from my own personal experience, having a co-moderator for an event, whether that person is on screen or not, um, is a really nice feeling to have. <laughs> and then finally, the third reason is around asynchronous communication. So your meetups happen monthly. Um, part of being a chapter leader means you'll also get a Discord channel in our Discord server, but there's all kinds of asynchronous communication that you can also have with your chapter members, be that through email or a WhatsApp group or however you choose to organize yourselves for conversation in between your meetups. That asynchronous communication, once you get more members, once you get your groove and more people showing up, can become kind of a lot. Again, a lot is good <laughs> when it starts to happen. This is not a problem, this is a benefit. Um, but I think that also it's a lot easier to welcome more when you have a co-leader. So how do you get a co-leader? That part's pretty straightforward. Uh, if you need support, adding somebody else as a, a co-leader to your chapter, always reach out to myself or Mike or Lil in our uh, in our Discord server. We'll be happy to help add somebody if you're not able to do it yourself. And we can also help you onboard that person. I hope that this is helpful and I hope that you have a fantastic start to your week. Talk to you soon.